Hey guys, welcome back. It's Sam with MobileTechVideos.com taking a look at a brand new ROM for the Galaxy Note 2 N7100. So today we're looking at a pretty cool new ROM. This is the Avatar ROM and it's brought to us by Bippy79 and the Avatar team. We'll go ahead and fire it up here. And this is really cool, uh, very exciting. This is based on Android 4.2.2, so the latest version of Android. It is uh, CyanogenMod 10.1. See our cool boot animation there. Uh, CyanogenMod 10.1 with MyUI style theming. Uh, and it's really cool. The theming on this is really awesome. You can do a ton of things. So you see we have a themed lock screen here. Uh, we can go into the phone by sliding that down, into the messaging by that, or... <laughs> we didn't get it in time. Or sliding straight down to launch the device. Now, ignore all these extras here. Those are the ones I've put on. Uh, what we have right out of the gate is the bazooka launcher. And I've been using this for several days now, uh, so I've got it pretty much set up the way I like it. But I went ahead and changed it back to the theme that uh, it comes with default here. This is a denim theme. And you see the icons look like they're in little pockets. But Bazooka Launcher, really cool launcher. Uh, got some nice visual transition effects here. The denim theme carries throughout. And this is 4.2.2, like I said. So you can just swipe over to get to the next panel here with your quick toggles. These are all customizable. You can also just click the little button up there. Click that to clear your uh, notification bar there. And a lot of customization on this ROM. In fact, to get to the drop down notification panel, pull straight down. I set it up to where if I pull a little bit over to the right, it pulls down the toggle notifications instead. So in the middle, that one, a little bit to the right, didn't get it, that one. So you can do that, you can set it up right or left, uh, it doesn't matter. And that is all set up in the settings menu here, within system. A lot of things to play around with in here. You can change the status bar, the power menu notification bar, power menu notification drawer, all kinds of things. You can customize your lock screen, although you'll probably be doing that with the theming instead. We'll go into the themes here. And you have a theme chooser, and this thing is awesome. Tons of stuff to look at. You can swipe over to look at online themes here. And you get a little preview. If you see one you like, click on it. And you get a couple screenshots. Down here you can choose to download it. We'll go ahead and start the download of this one. Uh, it's iPhone, which is, isn't my first choice, but you know, that's all right. And then we have a list here of all of the ones that we have downloaded. I really recommend Cobalt. I love that one. That's one I use primarily. Now our download is complete and there it is. So we can click on it and it will apply it. And there we go. We have a iPhone style look and feel. Let's check out our lock screen. You see you have the CRT off animation for this ROM which is cool. And we have our slide, maybe, does it slide? Oh, not the... I'm 
doing it too high? All right, hold on. Okay, I got it. I had to do it like really super fast. So I think before anything else happens, we're gonna go ahead and change that. Let's try the cobalt because that's the one I like the best. Cobalt has this nice uh, transparent. Actually, you might not even be able to see it. Hold on, let me turn this light off. There it is. Transparent thing going on here. Cool little accent down here at the bottom of your notification drawer. And then everything is black on the bl dark black and the blue. We've got a themed messaging app here and uh, I'm not crazy about the yellow and the simulated graph paper but in the thread it does say that it can be themed. So all in all guys a really nice ROM uh, the level of customization that you can do with this with the theming as well as the customizing the status bar and the navigation notification drawer and all of that is just incredible. I will put a link to where you can find this over on XDA. While you're over there be sure to thank the Avatar team for uh, all their hard work. The things they had to do to this ROM to be able to customize it like you can is just incredible. And uh, while you're over there guys be sure to hit them up with a donation so they can continue their hard work. And I appreciate you watching. As always this is Sam with MobileTechVideos.com signing off. Thank you.